The hidden meaning behind Kate's first new portrait since announcing her cancer diagnosis Kate admitted that while she's not out of the woods with her cancer treatment. In a personal message posted on June 14, the 42-year-old Princess of Wales shared her first health update since announcing her cancer diagnosis. The solo snap by photographer Matt Porteous was taken in Windsor, where she lives with Prince William and their three children. Along with a new photo, it's there that she finds her strength. It shows Kate, casually dressed in jeans and a blazer, posing with her arms crossed in front of a tree outdoors. As a proponent of forest bathing, the Japanese practice of immersing oneself in nature to recharge, the Duchess has long championed the benefits of nature for children and adults. I truly believe that interacting with nature and the outdoors has enormous benefits for our physical and mental health, she said in 2019. She could have posted a photo with Prince William or the kids, royal biographer Sally Bettle Smith told People in this week's cover story. Ailsa Anderson, a former press secretary for Queen Elizabeth, added, she could have posted a photo with Prince William or the kids. She has a lot of support around her, but it's a journey she has to tackle alone. It was thoughtful. Princess Kate commissioned Porteous to do the photo shoot. The photo shows her alone. The photographer has taken many portraits of the Prince and Princess of Wales family over the years, including a photo of Prince George's third birthday, a lovely photo of Prince Louis christening in 2018 and a snap of the family of five used for the annual Christmas card. Yes posted on Instagram, I am so honored and grateful to have had the opportunity to capture such a special moment. Princess Kate publicly announced her cancer diagnosis in an emotional video on March 22. After undergoing abdominal surgery in January, she was diagnosed with cancer and began chemotherapy. In a letter dated June 14, the Princess of Wales wrote, On my bad days, I feel weak, tired and need to rest. But on the days when I feel good and strong, I want to make the most of my health. On the days when I feel well enough. I enjoy taking part in school life, spending personal time on things that give me energy and positivity, and doing a little bit of homework, she added. I am learning to be patient, especially in times of uncertainty, the princess said. I'm taking each day as it comes, listening to my body and giving myself the healing time I need. The news also revealed that Kate will attend Trooping the Colour, the official celebration of King Charles' birthday, in London. On June 15, she made her first public appearance with the royal family since Christmas at the event taking a horse-drawn carriage ride to the procession and stepping out onto the balcony of Buckingham Palace to watch the fly past. It couldn't have come at a better time for her to be seen in public again, Bettle Smith said. She just couldn't stop smiling. She looked so happy to be there. It was very interesting to watch her. But the appearance doesn't mean she'll be returning to public life entirely. The Princess of Wales said she's starting to work from home and hopes to attend engagements in the summer, but no date has yet been set for her return to royal duties. Any outings over the next few weeks will be when she deems possible, under the guidance of her medical team. She's doing what's right for her and is recuperating privately at home. She's dealing with this in the best way she can, a royal source exclusively told People. Behind the scenes, Kate has begun working from home and meeting with her official team in Windsor when possible.